It's Mike Mack with Bungalow Chef, and we're here making a classic pineapple upside down cake. I'm using a 10 and a half inch iron skillet. We're getting it warm, medium heat, and we're adding three tablespoons of butter and a cup of brown sugar to caramelize. Okay. Okay, we're going to load it. We're going to turn it off. We're going to load it with the pineapple rings. And we're going to dot each pineapple ring with a maraschino cherry. Okay, we're going to remove from the heat. And now we're going to start making the batter. We're going to take three eggs. We're going to separate the eggs. We're going to take the egg yolks and we're going to beat them until they're very light in color. There we go. And now we're going to add a cup of sugar. Half a cup of pineapple juice. And we're going to add a teaspoon of vanilla. And we're just going to mix that through. OK. Move that to the side for now. We're going to take flour. We're going to take a cup and a half of all-purpose flour, a quarter of a teaspoon salt, and a teaspoon and a half of baking powder. We really want to mix the flour and the baking powder and salt together very well. And we want to add our yolks. All right. This is going to make a very stiff dough. Okay, I have to beat the egg whites and then we'll be folding it into the batter. We're ready to combine the egg whites into the batter. We just want to mix this very well. I usually try to cut the whites into the dough before we start mixing. There we go. Well combined. And we're going to pour the batter right over the pineapple and cherries. We just want to smooth the batter out a little bit. We're going to put it in the oven 350 degrees for about 35 minutes. We will want to check the center of the cake to make sure it's done and we'll be able to invert it and put it on a platter and ready for serving. And it's Mike Mack with Bungalow Chef. We just made a pineapple upside down cake.